change color but that's cool no that's not nice true courage is not the absence of fear it's persevering even though you're scared Aww. you only have to say one thing Mulo get squeaky Mulo get squeaky Mulo get squeaky get squeaky that's how I remember Marinette said it the first time and I couldn't understand what Oh wow! Oh hood! Oh, oh that's cute! Oh that's cute! Oh my gosh, that's so cute! You here? I know that we can do this. This will help you tear the mini mallet dictator sashes. Huh? You'll release the Amok and Akuma from every mini mallet dictator in Paris by calling upon your special power of multiplication. But what about the Sentin monster? It'll just clone more. You free the Parisians. I'll deal with the Sentin monster. How are you gonna do that? We just need a lot of people to take on the problem at the same time. That's what I always say about the fight for the environment. I told you, you have great ideas. Yeah, you do. <laughs> it's the only way to quickly spread your powers throughout Paris. It's natural to be scared. But you can go overcome my fear and go on to fight it. I know. I'm not scared. I can do this. I'm not scared. I'm so proud of you, Milen. I can do this. Who wants to do to do that but at the same time uh, come on load already I don't. Okay, shelter. Let's go. D. Yeah, 
craziness. Oh my gosh, that thing was ugly. Thank you, Ladybug. She did awesome. You know, I kind of like that now we're get, giving um, miraculouses to the ones who haven't been a in this season and no way I'm really off no as in we got oh yay give the pin give the pin oh that's a nice pin or little lucky charm magical charm but yeah I wonder if Ivan will get one I really am so sorry it's a good thing you were here to protect Paris I'm so worried about something Mayor what's gonna happen with Project Oxygen well uh it will have to be re-examined by a commission of experts, but... We're all counting on you to do the right thing. You know, I'm kind of surprised it took that many heroes to take down Mega Leech, but it's still cool like, how they work together. You've been incredibly courageous today, Milan. You should be proud of yourself. Bug out! Thanks to your allies, you stole my victory from me today, Lady Buck. But I'm already marching towards the next battle. What battle? You keep losing! Victorious one. <laughs> Parisians, I have heard the voices of our young There you go, more trees. A future where the plaster bones will remain, and the trees will continue to clean our air. Yes! They do it for free! condition and will be operated only by an adult who has read the instruction manual you may proceed. On behalf of your constituents, Fireman, oh my I'd gosh. Like thank you for the wise decision you've just made. I only did what was right, Miss Bustier. Congrats, Milan. You and Ivan won the battle. Woo! Together, uh, uh, good disability is quite difficult to flatten a tree. <laughs> we'll help you, Mr. Mayor. <laughs> It's good that we finally opened our eyes, even though you looked gorgeous in that commercial. What was that, Marinette? Uh, nothing! I just wanted to say that it was great that we all opened our eyes to the complex problems that were hiding behind that gorgeous commercial! That's what I meant, and not at all what I said before. <laughs> <laughs> Way to steal all ya. Adrian, you took a stand against me today. I didn't take a stand against you, Father. I took a stand against a project that my friend showed me was bad for Paris and for the planet. Adrian, go to your room. Yes, Father. Why are you doing that? Oh, is that what people have been talking about? That is that the hint that they've been... Oh, okay, this makes a lot more sense. Okay, though, I'm still positive that Adrian is not a Santi monster. Yet, yeah, there has been that um, big theory of Adrian being a Santi monster, and I remember when I heard about that theory, it didn't make sense. I'm like, oh, wait, you could be right. But no, 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 no. It, it's, in a way, impossible. Um, okay, well, in Miraculous, anything can be possible. But with this case, with this argument, Adrian's not a Santi monster. If he was then um hawk moth or gabriel would have summoned him or known where he was the whole time like if, does that make sense that's the thing sorry i i'm, I'm kind of stumped because the the theory of it is like it was cool at first but it's now it's now disproven because i think if you if the sending monster you know follows orders well there's plenty of times when gabriel was looking for uh Adrian while well, you know it was Cat Noir in season one and season two and season three. It's like there's so many like proof proofs that like how Adrian cannot be a Senti monster because of those reasons. But because of his background, I can see why people think he's a Senti monster because of what happened to maybe Emily and, and all the all the explanations of what's going on with him and how he's such a perfect kid, but the thing is, Adrian's not perfect, but he's he's trying to be perfect for his father. But, you know what, Thomas Osterk has surprised us so many times that if it does somehow turn out with a really good explanation that Adrian is a senti monster, yikes. Poor kid. But she's not even a kid anymore. Like, that's so sad. Adrian Cat Noir is my ultimate favorite character in The Miraculous Show. Like, I... And for him, I don't want anything bad to happen to him. I love his character and I understand the pain he's going through and all the things that he just 
he wants to um, be, like I can see his true self, what he wants to be. And I really feel bad for him a lot. So I, I really sympathize with him and that's why I love him. And he just wants to be the best cat, best friend, best, I don't know, <laughs> himself. He wants to be the best of himself, which Gabriel doesn't allow him to. But I get it. It's a, it's a mask, like, like put on a mask to show uh, what we want to be, but when we take the mask off, we show what everyone else wants us to see. Actually, it kind of be, is the opposite. For Adrian, it's the opposite. He puts on a mask, and he can be himself. Marinette puts on the mask, she has to be not herself, or in a way, a superhero. And when she's Marinette, she can completely be herself. And when Adrian is, well, Adrian, of course, not Cantoir, he has to put up a facade or a mask to be the perfect kid. He can barely be himself unless he's in his room with Plag. <laughs> Poor kid. Sorry, I, I, I went on to a lot of details and stuff. Sorry, my words are not the best, but I really do appreciate you guys who stay and listen to me. It's, it's, uh, it's a lot to process, but Marikas is such an incredible story and show. I'm... I'm so glad I am part of this fandom. I hope you guys are enjoying this as well, as much as I am, and I really thank you guys for watching my reaction. Um, yeah, I think that's all I really have to say. I mean, the episode itself, I'm kind of glad that Milan got uh, Miraculous, and I'm hoping, hey, maybe we'll find if uh, Ivan gets a Miraculous, and if he does, what? Maybe even Julika, or uh, who else is in this? Uh, well, we already know Alec already gets the Bunny Miraculous. So, I mean, Alex, sorry. Um, so, we already know that, but I wonder, wonder when she's gonna get that, so I'm excited for that. Um, and who else in the class has not get? Oh! Oh! I can't believe I forgot his name. Nate? Is it Nate? The artist who was Evil Illustrator. I would love to see him get a Miraculous. I wonder what kind of Miraculous he would get. Um, but same thing with all, all the others. Like, I can't wait to find out if this if this is how, where it's gonna lead to Marinette's whole class literally getting Miraculouses because, you know, they're... One thing, I feel like Hawkmoth should put it together that, hey, maybe Ladybug is part of the class because she only seems to choose people from that class except for Luca. Luca's on his own, but yeah. Okay, I'm gonna stop here because I really want to find out what happens next and I heard another episode is out in dub, so I will check that out. And I'll see you guys next week on another Miraculous Monday. And what did I say? Oh yeah, remember guys, be miraculous, simply the best, up to the test when things go wrong. Pound it. <laughs>